Hello. I've begun a retreat and I invite you to join me as we move into some prayer with God, something called the examine. Ignatius Loyola taught that to those who came under his teaching and it begins with thanks. Give thanks to God for what's going on in your life, any blessings. Thank you for the sun, for the ocean nearby here, for flowers, for people in our lives. Thank you for a measure of health, for food to eat, provision, for the salvation that comes through Jesus. Give thanks for all the blessings that come to mind and, and then ask for help. Holy Spirit, come and help us. Help us in our prayers. Help us in our lives. Help those who are in need. Help those who are in danger. Holy Spirit, come. Jesus said, I will give you a comforter and he will bring to remembrance all that I have taught you. So everything that we need uh, is there, available for us from the Holy Spirit. So we ask for help. And then review. Review our day. How, how has it been going? Or maybe it's morning time and you review yesterday. And see how God has been at work in your life. Uh, what's been going on? What, what, have, what things have led you to a place of desolation? Listening to the dark spirit, uh, the one who leads us into a place of hopelessness. And then where have you seen consolation? Where have you felt the love of God and been drawn into a, a greater relationship with God? What were those things that led you to that place? So kind of reviewing the day or, or the last hour or whatever it might be. And then we respond. As we review the day, maybe we give thanks, maybe we kind of think about things and say, I'd like to do that differently next time. But what kind of response do you have to that review of some portion of your day? And then a resolve, to resolve to make some amends perhaps, resolve to continue doing those good things that are bringing life to you and to others. But as we go through this process of giving thanks and asking for help and reviewing our day, responding to what God is doing and then making some sort of resolution, uh, something that God, the Holy Spirit, is calling us to do, it, it brings life. Let's pray together. Dear Father, we do give you thanks. I thank you for each one listening today. Bless them as they pray. And we ask for the help of your Holy Spirit. As we look back over this last period of time, we thank you for the ways that you've been walking with us. Uh, we realize that there are times when we've listened to a voice other than yours, and, and maybe that's led us to a place of desolation. But Lord, you've given us great consolation in your Holy Spirit because of what Jesus has done for us. And we thank you for the reminders of that in this last time period. Lord, we respond with, again with thanksgiving, with a kind of awareness of your work in our lives, and we resolve to do those things that you put on our hearts. I pray for each one listening that you would speak to them and let them know what a next step might be for them. Maybe it's clearing out some clutter of life, whether it's in the mind or in some other way, maybe it's going and speaking to someone that they've need to, needed to talk to for some time. Whatever it might be, I pray that you would give them the energy and strength and joy as they go out to do your will and to bring blessing to others, just as you have blessed us. We pray giving thanks in Jesus' name. Have a wonderful day.